What's up? It's Chris from Stone Fox Media. And before I start my video, I want to give my congratulations to Broken Games HD, who just recently graduated from college. That's no small feat. Now, moving on to actual gaming news. Uh, the PlayStation 4 is sold out almost everywhere in South Korea following successful launch, uh, successful worldwide launch. Uh, South Korea is basically uh, defined as a motherland of PC gaming, at least due to how popular games like StarCraft and League of Legends are locally, but Korean gamers aren't really against entertaining themselves with consoles as well, and Sony can add another country to its PlayStation 4 tally. The PlayStation uh, launched in that country on the 17th, and Sony Computer Entertainment Korea announced that today with the press release that the console has already sold out almost everywhere, while initial numbers have not been given. Sony has not introduced uh, you know specific numbers by nation, but basically they're fucking sold out in Korea too. It seems like everywhere that they launch, they just sell out and then they create some new record basically so I mean I'm going to still stick with my original standpoint that everywhere they announce they sell out and then they're going to have some gigantic numbers that's going to happen next year but no one's going to fucking say any numbers now because saying it every week is just very monotonous and it's just it's, it's not smart okay you wait till after Christmas you tally up the actual numbers and you give us the real freaking digits uh, when you move on to some actual Xbox news apparently uh, there's official official Twitter account that asked for support for help on a known uh, connect bug, and you know, then they delete the tweet, the, the whole entire tweet, and then the whole entire hilarity ensued. Basically, so basically, uh, one of the uh, Xbox One bugs had surfaced on the, on the launch of the Connect, being displayed as not connected, even though it's plugged in. And the rather hilarious turn of events, many just saw the official Xbox One Twitter account asking the Xbox support account for help with exactly the <laughs> with help about the same damn glitch. Uh, the tweet has since been deleted, but not before some Hawkeye users on NeoGAF caught it on film, causing quite a bit of hilarity, and at the moment they do not know the tweet was just a joke or a prank by an employee, but basically there was an update where apparently the tweet was sent by mistake by a Microsoft social media manager that forgot to log out of their official account and then log into her personal account before tweeting it. So that was a tweet to their actual, you know, personnel there. And they're trying to ask for help with their own problems. I don't even know how the fuck that works out. Not really super hilarious to me, but just shocking to hear them, you know, go through this drama with themselves. Okay, fix your own problems. Please don't tweet about it. Uh, with the whole entire Xbox thing, the Xbox and PS4 wars that's been going on, there's actually this, this video from, from the Fine Brothers that came out, or whatever, where uh, kids react to the, you know, battle between the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox, and they show, you know, how kids react to, to the whole entire thing, and it's just hilarious, and I feel like I should, you know, put that uh, link in the description, because it's a great video, it's just hilarious to watch these kids respond and react to this whole entire PlayStation 4 Xbox One thing, because they don't generally... They really don't fucking care. And when you see them, their reaction is like, why'd you pull out guns? Don't you know I'm a kid? It's like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and check out that video. Uh, that's all the news I got for you guys today. I got to head out and go, you know, do some final Christmas shopping. Running out of time. So uh, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and I'll holler at you guys later.